Hey guys, Will here. I'm at my home field, but thought I'd take a 30 minute drive and check out a new LZ that my buds will be flying out of tonight. Any chance I get to fly a new site, I try to take it. But I do get the butterflies in my stomach. And I've ignored them in the past and lived to regret it, so <laughs> I guess you could say I've learned to embrace the butterflies. Every field that I've flown out of has one thing in common, and that's that they're all just a little bit different. And if I don't pay attention to those differences, man, that, <laughs> that could be the difference between me having a really good day or a really bad day. So I'll check it out. I'm already expecting not to fly. Kind of got that mindset. That way I won't be disappointed. And hey, if everything's good though, I'll send it. So glad I came to this event tonight. It's a great little turnout too. Had uh, about seven of us. Thank you, Alan Surratt, for the invite. I always love checking out new places, new LZs. It's a great little airport. And the conditions tonight were just perfect when I got there. The wind was right down the runway. I didn't have to worry about any obstacles, no turbulence, no rotor, nothing. I mean, it was freaking butter. So I just pulled up, threw my wing out, put the motor on my back, and up, up and away. Matter of fact, I was the first one up. Yep. That's not exactly how things went. I got there at 445 and checked things out, did a little kiting, but things just didn't look good to me. And first up, it was a brand new LZ to me. I had never flown it. That in and of itself would not keep me from flying. But checking out the wind socks, one of them was showing a direct crosswind to the runway. And the other was just laying down. So the winds were a bit switchy. Next, looking at the launch area, it's pretty darn narrow. And, and even more narrow based on the direction I'd have to launch because of the wind direction. Also, there were obstacles on both sides. And that made me think about mechanical turbulence. I mean, there had to be some rotor coming off those tall trees and turbulence coming off those buildings. Also, it was still early, so it was still thermally. And oh yeah, it's an airport, so there might just be some airport stuff going on. While any one of these things wouldn't necessarily keep me grounded. When I put them all together and look at the big picture, it was pretty easy to see that it wasn't a good time for me to go fly in there. So I just tied in a little bit more, talked to my friends, and paid real close attention to pilots that were launching before me. I wanted to know what that wing was gonna do as soon as they brought it up over their head. Yeah. There were some failed launches, but there were a lot of successful ones too. The thing is, the longer I waited, the more successful the launches seemed to become. So that wasn't my solution. Uh, it was just a matter of waiting for things to settle down before I sent it. I'm glad I did. Dang, man. I freaking lost my phone. That sucks. It's probably down there somewhere. No, it's okay. No wonder I don't have any music. I don't have my phone. And Raleigh East, uh, anyone on the ground? Do you read me? Yeah, you're loud and clear. Anyone find a phone down there? Uh, I can ask. Maybe they'll look around. Thank you, sir.
I think he's gonna do a water foot drag. Yeah. Okay, this go around, I'm gonna try it again, but I'm gonna try to be stabilized in my altitude before I get to the water. That was a good time. I'm glad I came. And by the way, I found my phone. <laughs> I gotta find my phone. Where'd you take off? Over there, right here. Are you kidding me? It, it was like right on my belt. Todd, coming in from a hard day's work. Man! <laughs> I'm gonna do a fun check here. Was it fun, Eduardo, even though you didn't fun. fly? Yeah, a lot of fun. <laughs> fun check. Hell yeah. yeah Eric? Awesome. Fun. Fun was check. it fun? Yeah, it was a ton of fun. <laughs> okay. Was it fun? It was awesome. All right, man. <laughs> Doing a fun check over here. Was it fun? Oh. How about you, Alan? Man, it was amazing. <laughs> That's it guys, that's another new experience, Flight 400 at a new field. Great airport. But you know, if I had done what I did and just let things chill out and be patient, hey, it might have been a different experience altogether. Well, that's all I've got for you tonight. I hope you all enjoyed the video. I had fun making it, and until next time, ciao. Lost my motor. Started right back up.